There's arguably no statistic more important to know before purchasing a printer than how much it can print and or copy in a month. When you're researching a specific machine's specifications, you're likely to see two categories that involve the volume with which the printer can be used, monthly duty cycle and recommended monthly print volume. There's a major difference between a printer's duty cycle and recommended monthly print volume. I'm Mary Schamberger, and I'm the Business Development Manager at STPT. I've been answering customers' questions about copiers and printers for 13 years, and I've had all kinds of training from leaders in the industry. In this video, I'm going to explain what is a printer's duty cycle, what is a printer's recommended print volume, and three ways to check how much you print in a month. So first, what is a printer's duty cycle? A printer's duty cycle is the maximum number of prints or copies the machine can produce in a given month, and it is set by the manufacturer of the product. The duty cycle of a printer will be determined largely by the size of the machine. The bigger the machine is, the higher the duty cycle will be. You might commonly see duty cycles in the hundreds of thousands. The duty cycle is very high, but think of it like the speedometer on your car. Your car can go 100 miles per hour, but if you go 100 miles per hour all day, every day, what happens? You'll need new tires sooner, frequent oil changes, and overall probably more maintenance, not to mention maybe some speeding tickets. Anyway, that is what duty cycle is to your printer. It's what it can do, but should you run that volume all the time? No. And this is where recommended print volume comes from. A printer's recommended monthly print volume is the number of prints or copies you can safely make on the machine in a month, and like duty cycle, it's set by the printer manufacturer as well. The major difference between duty cycle and recommended print volume is that the recommended print volume is about 10% of the printer's overall duty cycle. So, should you follow a printer's duty cycle or recommended print volume? you should always follow a printer's recommended monthly print volume. Here are three ways to check how much you print in a month. Number one, check your current printing bill. Checking your current printer or copy your invoice will serve as the most accurate form of examining your current monthly print volume. And if utilizing a maintenance plan for your current machine, your invoice will likely tell you exactly how much you print or copy each month. Number two, check your printer's meter reads. Meter reads tell you how many impressions or total prints and copies you've made, and it usually is found in the machine's settings or on a printed report. Take the meter reading you discovered and divide it by the number of months you've owned that machine. This will provide a close calculation of your monthly print volume. The third main option you can use to check your print volume is the simplest, but it's also the least accurate. If the previous two options aren't possible for you to complete, you can gauge how much paper or paper reams you go through each month to give you a rough estimate to work with as you search for a machine that can safely handle your monthly print volume. If you need help determining what your monthly print volume is, contact us by submitting the request to quote form. We can absolutely help you find out how much you're printing and consult you on which machine would be a good fit for you.